All right, guys. So um, after I did the the drawers, um, I was having a look at the bed, and uh, you guys know that there was a little piece that was coming out, which was just a piece of crap, and I didn't like it at all. So uh, I've completely binned it. I took off the slats that were there, and I put it on this uh, movable area. Um, so these, all these slats are, are proper fixed. There's going to be no sliding part here. So that got me thinking. Let me move this stuff out of the way. That when it's nighttime mode, of course this comes out. So what's going to happen there, and what's going to happen here? Yeah. So um, what I was thinking is, since that's going to be the head side, that'll be body and feet. Uh, what I'll do is I'll build the same structure as this uh, but to fit here so when it's nighttime mode so when it's daytime mode it will live somewhere there when it's nighttime mode I'll just put it there and then that way this extends that has its part and that I think I'll just keep empty over there because um, my head will be there so I, I don't need that entire space to sleep uh, with my head so yeah, and if I if I choose and I want to put my head there and my feet there, then I just move that piece over there. So I think that's what I'll do. Um, so today, um, this is the state of the van, as you can see. Um, this is the the little cushion that came originally with the van. I mean the the bed that came with the van. So I'm going to cut this up and you know fit it in there. But anyway, the plan today. Oh, I stopped recording. Uh, but anyway, uh, what I was saying is that the plan is to paint the bed, uh, bed today. Uh, so we'll paint the frame white and then those little drawers, two of them, uh, white and then the facing that goes over it uh, with the pallet wood will be sanded and then painted a dark oak uh, colour. So I think that will contrast really well throughout the van. Um, so that's the mess right now. Uh, so let's get this stuff out and then let's get painting.
All right, guys, that's one cut of, cut of paint. I've just finished with the bed. Uh, so what I'm going to do now, I'm going to give this bad boy a second coat because it's dried off quite nicely. Um, and then by the time I finish that, uh, I might do something to that. And then by the time I've done that and that, that will be dry. So I'll give that a second coat and those should be dry. Then I'll give that a second coat and then it should be good. guys everything's now got a second coat it's looking good um, you'll see there's some parts inside I've left because you're not gonna see it so there's no point so that's the bed just drying off the drawers second coat of paint uh, on top and on the sides but underneath you're not gonna see it that much so I've left it and that's that little extendable part so that's drying off nicely, so uh, I think I'm going to get onto the slats next. <sighs> Alright guys, break time over. Um, the parts have dried off nicely, so I'm just letting them just stay out there and dry even more. But they're, they're dry to the touch, so all good. Uh, the next step is um, I'm just going to try it first with these five planks. So these five planks here go on the uh, part of the bed that's movable, that small little uh, square part which is that one there uh, so what I'm looking to do is paint these with this type of dark uh, oak I think it's called let me have a look yeah English oak color um, I think the contrast is going to look really nice with the white but I just want to do those five ones first and see that it doesn't look too crazy um, and then what I'll do is um, I'll then paint the rest of the slats for the bed uh, in that colour and then also what I'll do is I'll take these off these flip, flipping ones and then uh, recolour that and uh, recolour this part here All right, guys, so that's the dark oak panels painted. I think on the white, it looks really nice. Uh, each brown seems to be slightly different shade, which makes it even more awesome. So that bright white with the uh, dark oak looks awesome. So definitely that across the entire bed will just look amazing. Even though I know it's a part you don't get to see much, um, but it will look good so 
I'm going to go ahead and do that. We've got some clear skies coming my way. Those dark ones have just gone and they're on their way out. And I have all of that to look forward to. So I'm going to go ahead and start painting up all those over there. Let it dry out. Uh, and then I think with some with the gold screws, that's going to look real cool. But yeah, let's do that. Look at the difference that one just got the second coat that's still on the first one so definitely one more coat uh, on the rest of them should be perfect perfectly fine and that will uh, be a really nice beautiful dark color